Hello and hi everybody, welcome back to another one at this time. I'm doing another one from SML Theory and this one is Why is Foxy a good guy in SML FNAF? Yeah, I do wonder that. Why is Foxy a good guy in SML FNAF? But you know, in the original games, he'll fucking kill you. He doesn't care who you are or what you are. If you're a person, someone living, a, a living person, and he sees your ass, he's gonna want to kill you. So, let's see uh, what kind of theories we, uh, or SMO Theory has, on why Foxy could be a good guy. So, with that being said, if you have not yet subscribed to SMO Theory, the link to the original is in the description down below. Be sure to go subscribe to SMO Theory if you have not yet already. So, with that being said, let's get into this. Have you ever wondered why Foxy's a good guy, but every other animatronic continuously tries to kill all the characters? And yeah. why Foxy has been the reason that Jeffy and Marvin survived in Five Nights at Freddy's 2? And why Junior and Brooklyn guy survived in Five Nights at Freddy's 3? Well, my theory is that this is based off of the Foxy's a good guy theory that was, and still is, extremely popular ever since the Five Nights at Freddy's 1 game. The series says that the reason he jump scares you in the first game is because he's making sure you're safe, which sounds weird, but what? the reason he checks on you when you look at him too much or too little is because if you look at him too much he'll think that you're trying to summon him for his help but if you don't look at him on the cameras enough he'll think you're in trouble because you're not checking the camera uh. and it also says that when foxy jump scares you he screams to ward off any other animatronics that may be coming so he can what? protect you i've never heard that theory before i am n I'm, I'm not even kidding with you guys i've never heard that theory before even back in the day when i used to play finance phrase a shit ton i never heard that theory once before so this is like new to me but in the game he gives you a so-called heart attack and you die anyway now this theory has been argued for quite some time on whether or not it's real but in the sml universe it is 100 percent real Apparently. so why is he so nice to everyone except to his fellow animatronics well in the game as well as in the sml episodes the three main animatronics freddy bonnie and chica are all on stage together as one group however mm -hmm. foxy's inside of pirate's cove away from everyone else possibly because he was outcast which could have built some resentment between the animatronics and foxy would start to hate them for what they did to mm. him as well at the end of the first episode jeffy beats up bonnie and Sheikah and then runs back to broken guy's car but then foxy starts chasing after them ah, mm. I'm guessing you lost. no foxy's chasing me oh, <laughs> Yeah, we all thought Foxy was going to be another animatron that kills you in the episodes, but apparently he means no harm. He wants to be a good guy. I wonder if that's actually the case in the actual games. But Foxy in, SM in F9 Nights Freddy 2, he still jumps at you anyway if you don't check the lights or check him in the hall. Okay, Jeffy, I think we finally outran him. Now let's go get some McDonald's and go home. But if he's nice, why is he chasing them if he's trying to leave? Well, using my theory, there are multiple reasons to why he's nice, and there's an explanation for him chasing after the car, and it's that he really badly needed a ride to his cousin's house. Mm. Oh, God. Are you going to ask what happened? Well, did you get off your job early? Well, no, we were almost killed. Yeah, the animatronics came to life and tried to kill us. So then I had to beat some ass. Yeah, he pizza did. Ass. What? Well, yeah, remember that pizzeria I told you about that's kind of like Chuck E. Cheese? Well, that turns out all the animatronics are haunted and they all tried to kill us. But then Jeffy kicked all their asses. But then as we were driving away, the Fox one, Foxy, popped up in our back seat. And we thought he was going to eat us. But it turns out he's actually a pretty cool dude. He just wanted us to drop him off at his cousin's house. So yeah. Like, who is Foxy's cousin? If Foxy's an animatronic, his only real cousins would be the other animatronics, which does make me a bit suspicious, but we'll get back Mangle. to that. The first reason is that he could have faked being nice because he wanted the ride to his cousin's house. Because inside the restaurant on Jeffy's first day, Foxy was chasing them and it looked like he was trying to kill yeah. them. It was only after Foxy got in their car that we really knew that he was nice and wasn't going to kill them. So it could be that once Foxy realized that they had a car, then he would be nice to Jeffy and Broken Guy just so he could get a ride. But I can sort of disprove this and show you that Foxy was nice nice to them the entire time. As proven in episode 3, when Broken Guy is talking to Foxy, Foxy can't speak. Sorry kid, we're gonna die. I never thought I'd die in an air vent. Wait, kid, do you hear a skateboard? I do hear a skateboard! It's Foxy! Yeah, kick his ass, Foxy! Yeah, 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 yeah. Get him! Get him, Foxy! Wait, is Foxy good? Oh yeah, he's awesome. Hey, hey Foxy, Foxy, can you get us out of here? Thanks. <laughs> 
Thanks so much for saving us, Foxy. All right, kid, let's get the hell out of here. There's not much to do in the third game anyway. Mm. Which is important because in the first Five Nights at Freddy's episode, when Broken Guy and Jeffy are checking the cameras, the animatronics had moved, but Broken Guy thought it was just Jeffy pranking him, and so they moved them back. Wait, the animatronics aren't there! No, what not? The animatronics aren't there anymore! Huh, yeah, they sure aren't, are they? I told you they were moving! Oh, well, maybe the security camera's just glitching. Let's go check it out. Okay, let's see what's going on. Oh, yeah, I forgot it's dark. Let me get a flashlight. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, Freddy! I told you he could move! Oh, I see what's going on here. Okay, it's your first day on the job and you're trying to prank the veteran. Ha uh -huh, you got me. I didn't move him! He moved on his own! He can't move on his own. Yes, he can! But then the animatronics start to move way more and Broken Guy and Jeffy start to get scared and then Foxy starts running to the door probably to try to warn them that the animatronics are getting angrier. And even after they go outside to check on the animatronics, after realizing they can move, they go back to the office and Foxy's waiting for them there, but he doesn't move or try to scare them. It's only when Broken Guy opens the door to run away that Foxy then chases after them to try and get them to realize that Foxy's just trying to help them. Oh no, he's stretching. He is getting ready to run. He can run the 40 yard dash in three seconds. Yeah. Oh, three no. seconds. oh no, we gotta go. We gotta go, 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 go,
comments. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and click on this video here. Well, we'll find out what happens in us in, uh, in the Finance of Freddy's 4 episode. I'm assuming it's gonna, upload, it's gonna get uploaded today, if I'm not mistaken. Um, because, yeah, because it's been two weeks since uh, FNAF 3 came out. And before that, it was two weeks before that, it was FNAF 2 and then FNAF 1. So, I'm just assuming today will be the day FNAF 4 will come out. So, I'm just hoping. I'm really hoping. I'm really, really hoping. Because <laughs> I've been waiting for the last two weeks, like I said, for Five Nights at Freddy's 4 to come out. And I really want to see what goes on in this video. And who knows? Maybe Foxy is an actual good guy, or he's pretending to be good just to uh, lure all the characters into something so they would all get killed. We'll see what, ha what happens in the Five Nights at Freddy's 4 episode. I'm so excited. I'm so hyped for that video. You guys, you probably don't understand how hyped I am for that video. It's gonna be crazy. So with that being said, if you, ha um, <laughs> if you, if you enjoy this, be sure to give this video a like. If you have not yet subscribed, be sure to do so right now. Turn on notifications to be notified for any video that I upload. And I'll catch you guys later in the next one whenever I start doing that. So hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys later. So take care.